While Chloe Sevigny was making American Psycho, she started to feel like the title might also describe her co-star. Sevigny struggled to jive with Christian Bale's more method-acting approach. I was trying to respect his process, which I found challenging because I'm very gregarious and silly and goofy, unbeknownst to the general public, she told Vanity Fair. When people take themselves so seriously, I kind of shut down, even though I take my work very seriously and I love acting and whatnot. I was really intimidated by his process and intimidated by him, she continued, and I wanted a little more generosity to make myself feel more at ease, which is my own ego. It was a really challenging dynamic for me, but I don't think that I thought he was bad. I was just kind of confused, like, why aren't you being social? I wasn't even that aware of what the method thing was. I never had any formal training. I think I was just kind of fake it until you make it. But the whole method thing, I was like, what even is this approach? It was very intimidating. Sevigny admitted her struggles to American Psycho co-star Josh Lucas as the two reminisced about their time on the film. Lucas portrayed one of Patrick Bateman's, Bale, colleagues, while Sevigny played Bateman's secretary. Lucas confessed that it wasn't so much an issue with Bale's less-than-friendly approach to his work, as he just didn't get the choices Bale was making at all. I don't know if you felt this way, but I actually truly remember thinking that Christian Bale was terrible, he said, with a laugh. I remember the first scene I did with him. I watched him, and he seemed so false. And I now realize that it was this just F-I-N-G brilliant choice that he was making. That was an actor who was at such a completely different level already, Lucas continued. And that he was capable of having these crazy layers going on in what he was doing. I thought it was bogus acting at the time, but was exactly the opposite. The two actors also dissected Bale's version of method acting and the ways it contrasts with a more toxic approach to performing that uses that label as an excuse for bad behavior. Here's a really weird bridge, as you know, between bad method actors, who I find really, really terrible to work with, and the ones like Christian, Lucas reflected. Christian's not paying attention to F-I-N-G anything else but what he's doing. I have nothing but admiration for that, because a lot of method actors are actually kind of distracting with the fact that their process is more important than anything or anybody else. Sevigny also clarified that part of her struggle to understand Bale's process was due to the fact that they were both child actors, which often limits one's exposure to more traditional formal training that would result in a Methodist process. It's kind of surprising that Christian would be emotionally invested the way he is, because he was a child actor, she concluded. It's not like he studied in college and then became this Method Y, Brando Y kind of thing. He found this journey from being a child actor to then an adult actor that I think is a really interesting trajectory, and I'm curious about that. Sevigny and Lucas are both campaigning for Emmy nominations currently, with Sevigny earning notice for her performance in Feud, Capote vs. The Swans and Lucas charming voters with his turn in Palm Royale.